Hey guys, Gemma from. Oh, I didn't know you were. <laughs> oh. Are you gonna say you it? Can't just, well, you can't just make me say it every time. <laughs> <laughs> it's not every time. ASD rocks. Um, really important, massively important one today. There have been a lot, a lot, a lot of comments. What's happened with ASD rocks the last like 72 hours, Bo? It's gone viral. <laughs> it's, it's gone viral. I do not know what happened. We've been doing this. How many years have we been doing this for now? I, three? I'm not too sure. Five? You were in oh, primary yeah. school? Oh, yeah, of course. Um, and for some reason, unknown reason, last 72 hours, boom, viral. And some people are saying that you don't understand what you're doing or what it's about or what's mm. going on. So what is ASD Rocks? ASD Rocks is, I'm pretty sure, a project that we've been doing Great to word for it. help people understand what autism is like. Yep, yep. 100%. Anything else? Um, that's the best I can explain it. Where Where is it put? It's put from everyone's perspective, not just mine. Like, how other people see me, like my brother and you. Yeah. As well as, as well as me, like, as well as other people. Yeah, yeah, totally. Not just mine. No, no, that's right. It's about what it's like to be, you know, be a brother, what it's mm. like to be a mother, what it's like to, you know, um... And, but where is it? Not where? Not not how is it put? Where is it put? You know that it's out there to be viral. Where does it have to go? On the end. There you go. All right. <laughs> That's right. And um, how do you feel about ASD rocks? Um. Well, I do find it helpful for people who are not understanding autism. Mm. Yeah, totally, totally. I think so too. Um, and do you think we're doing it? Do you think what we're doing is a good thing, or do you think that it's, you know, invading privacy? Um, other times it can be good. Other times it can invade my privacy a bit. Yeah, and when it does, what do you do? I just tell them that uh, you. I don't think I would want to do this right now. Or well, yeah. Necessarily. And that has happened. Like, it, there has been a mo time that where I think the ASD Rocks recording thing was a bit unnecessary. Like, mm. there has been times mm. where that's happened. And I, and she has listened. She being me. Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I do listen. Of course I listen. You're my yeah. you're my buddy. And what do you say? You say please don't put this on ASD Rocks. And that has happened. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that I have been told that there are people saying that I don't get a say in this. And I do. Because it has happened. It's that's a hundred percent true. Yeah, he's autistic. He's not stupid, <laughs> right? Mm. Totally. There is a massive difference. I think a lot of people don't understand autism as well. Mm. So they think that um, you don't know what's going on, like because you have autism, that you don't understand um, that there are like pedophiles out there that you don't which do you know that yes hell yeah you do um that you don't understand how the internet works or that you don't understand things and do you of course i do <laughs> well i know that but you need to tell them oh. <laughs> of course i do <laughs> Yeah, um, and also there are people that completely disagree with what I have to say, and I want them to, and I don't mind. I don't mind, because everybody has an opinion, right? So sometimes, like, the way I handle things with you, sometimes I, I lose my shit, right? Yeah. And do sometimes, do you sometimes lose your shit? Yeah. What are, we're just human. Yeah. We're just people. Nobody's perfect. 
I wouldn't want to be perfect. I like you just the way you are. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't, we're not trying to make this an Instagram pretty, like, false reality thing. This ASD Rocks is raw. It's real. It's real life. It's yeah, not, not a robot. You're not a robot. And, you know, we're not just trying to get followers. We're, we're trying to do something, right? Yeah, we're trying to make make people understand what autism is so we can make the world a better place. You know what? You just make my world a better place by being in my world. <laughs> I love you so much, man. Um, although I must admit your brother seems to have gone more viral than you. Do you remember when you got that um, that sand that sand gift? The, the frame that's in the... Uh, oh, yeah. Well... What I didn't notice at the time was that Finn started eating the polystyrene foam while you were, well, videos. <laughs> and everyone's like writing comments going, did anyone check out the brother? The mum's all like, don't worry, we can send it back. Oh, not anymore. The brother just ate it. What? <laughs> like, what? I have to show you the comments. Oh my God, they're so funny. Now, the other thing is, <laughs> he's gone. He is, what? It's so funny, Bo. Like, oh my god, some he's just gone. Yeah, he's gone viral for being like the ASD advocate or something. Yeah, I have seen my brother gone on a YouTube video. Oh, like, someone from a YouTuber. else. So, yeah, a you I have seen that happen. A you yeah, a YouTuber um, t twice. Once he was the little guy in the hat, and then one time. What was it? Do you remember you showed me? You were like, look, that's Finn on his game. He was playing a game. The YouTuber was trying out a game and Finn's character was on there. Or was it you? Was it your uh, character? No, no. I, I was more so thinking the time he was, he was getting his hair, rainbow haircut. Yeah. Yeah. The, I remember that time too. Um, people just saw a clip of the rainbow haircut and, sit, and it was put in a compilation of like awesome hairstyles and stuff. Mm. Yeah, no, we understand. So you understand how videos get seen, you understand how yep. they get shared, you understand how they get clipped and cut and put together yep. and you know how it all works. Um, you know that there are sick, depraved people out there. <laughs> Sorry, someone called right in the middle of that. So, as I was saying, you understand that there are like sick, depraved, weirdo people out there and we stay away from them. Also, you don't have Facebook, do you? No. You don't have Instagram? No. You don't have Snapchat? No. You don't, you're not interested in no, any of I'm that? No, I'm not. I, the closest I have to social media is just YouTube and not, not even, and even then I don't really set up an account. No, exactly. So... You're pretty untouchable unless they go through me, right? Mm. Like, no one can send you messages or groom you or whatever the, mm. the you know, people are worried about because... I don't need to be cleaned further. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know, Stinky Bum. You're about to go to the gym. You're going to need a oh. cleaning after that. <laughs> um... So you're totally cool and happy with everything, even though it's gone viral and around the world. In fact, it's probably helping more people, I guess. When I found out my brother got millions of years, I was like, oh my God, oh my God. Like, it was a real shock to me. I know, and I, I heard you fall down on the bed when he <laughs> told you that. You were like, ah, ah. <laughs> I heard you totally fall down. Your Finn ran in and was like, "There's been something like oh, I can't remember. What, did he say a million views? I can't." Yeah, remember. he did say a million views. Yeah, and you were just like, "What?" I know because we've gone from like just our really close small group of like ASD rock stars, the people that have been watching us and watching the story over the last five years, to all of a sudden. People just like watching one clip and just going, this is ridiculous. What is this? I don't know. What we is went this? from a nobody to a somebody. Well, we were always somebodies to a few we people. Went, yeah, just... We went from a small somebody to a big somebody. Is what we I'm went to from say. a big fish in a little pond to, you know, a, I don't know if we're little fish. I, we're probably still little fish, it, but it's a much, much, much bigger pond. Um, but I do think it will settle down once people sort of, like heaps of people, do you know what they did when they saw that video of you eating the, um, eating the hamburger, remember?
but when you had what? the first, someone was like, don't give him that, put sauce on it. It's too dry. Put caramelized onions on it. Put... Suffer. What? <laughs> I just tried to crack a joke that just going to suffer beyond my comfort. <laughs> It would be like, so, they, and I think half the people that are watching the videos don't even know that you have autism, and they're like, "Oh, mm. what a shit mum! She's giving him the shittiest hamburger ever. She's not got any sauce on it. Mm. She's not putting. What would you do if I put sauce or onions? I probably wouldn't eat it. Not a, yeah. I just avoid it at all costs. At all costs. How hard was it for you to just to try that hamburger for the first time? It was a bit. It was a bit. Of a, I don't want to say overwhelming, but... No, that can it, be a good word. It was a bit... shaky, but... Well, like... I was having a shaky feeling. Mm. But I did... I was able to try it, because it was improvised. It was put together from things that you already mm. knew. Right? So it was like, you knew bread, you knew cheese and you knew the, the meat patty that we always cook for you so it was put together from already recognized foods mm. and and you liked it yeah yeah um and i think and it's awesome but yeah people were like oh that's disgusting <laughs> don't give it to me boss yeah i made it don't worry i made it disgusting <laughs> 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 nice. I made my food disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. No, so, don't make it disgusting. Don't worry, I made it disgusting. <laughs> totally. So I can comprehend my actions. Yeah, because food, what would you... I would say food is probably your hardest thing with autism, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. Like, out of all of the things, like, you've learned how to talk, you've learned how to, you know, read, well, you always could read, but yeah. you've learned how to even, you know, um, say hi to, like, people that mm -hmm. come to the house, you're learning to interact more, um, you're not running away as much, and, but still, of all the things that really is, is difficult. It's food, or trying new food. Yeah, what is it about that? I don't know. It's like the mis it's like the fear of the unknown, like how it's gonna taste. Yeah? Yeah, I don't know if it's gonna be bad, I don't know if it's gonna be good. Yeah. Yeah. Um It's it's just what do you know what? It is really common with mm. kids with autism. Like so and there's you know what, it's even common with kids that don't have autism, to be truthfully honest. Um like there are there are kids that have other eating problems, yeah. difficulties um, that that has nothing to do with autism. So we just we just keep on keeping on, don't we? Yeah, we just keep on going. That's what we do. Are you happy? Yeah. Uh, do you feel safe? Yeah. Do you feel loved? Yeah. Do you feel like you wish you had different a different mum? A different dad? No. A different brother? No. No! Don't take my brother away from me! I love my brother! Um, totally. Um, that's what that's... Did I tell you what to say in, in any of these answers? No. No? So this, this is... This is just for me. Yep. This is just what I think. Like, it's not scripted in any way. No, it's not. It's not. Our life isn't scripted. Is it? No. It is, um, our life is just a new thing every day and we just deal with what we have to deal with. Some days we have good days, some days we have super shitty days, mm. some days we feel comfortable putting things on the internet and some days we don't. Mm. Yeah. So, all right, well, I think, I think we've covered any, everything. Um, I can't think of anything else, but, uh, let's, let's see how people go with this. <laughs> I'm sure someone will have a problem with it. They always do. But, um, mm. well, hopefully this will... Lighten things up? Hopefully. Hopefully. Because people can be quite rude mm. um, and take things out of context. And, you know, it's, it's almost like they yell at you for doing something and then don't realise that they're the ones being mm. really offensive and rude. Um, mm you know, attacking characters and things like that. And so